Hi, welcome to Inner Beauty TV. I'm Nicole Michelle, and today's ladylike lesson will be about feminine influence, aka feminine charm. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the Inner Beauty TV. I'm Nicole Michelle, and every lady at some point needs to know about feminine influence and feminine charm. It's one of those things that lets feminine women kind of uh, bring out the masculinity in men and get what they want and to a lot of women it's confusing because they don't understand it how feminine women seem to beguile men or charm men it's really simple and today I'm going to cover some of those things that you um, who are watching this video can start today to enhance your feminine charm First, we have to understand what feminine charm or feminine influence really is. Now, influence or feminine influence or feminine charm is when a woman uses her femininity, her friendliness, and her uh, uh, mix of flirtation um, to even the playing field or eliminate competition between the masculine and the feminine. So usually it's used in situations where uh, feminine women or um, can beguile the masculine energy to reduce their wall or make them feel relaxed in situations and kind of get what they want. Um, when used properly, men love feminine charm. It, now, friendliness is broken down into basically just smiling, laughing, finding the humor in things, making others around you relaxed, making eye contact, um, not being so serious all the time. Um, you can conduct business, but you're still a little relaxed and you are confident in your skin. When you smile and you laugh, you are relaxed, your facial muscles are relaxed, and people around you feel relaxed. And this allows the energy between you and the other person to kind of just flow without walls being up. And women who have feminine charm are confident and they're self-assured. And they are pretty confident that once they make the other party comfortable in their presence, they can pretty much get what they want. And this is why women who are in their masculine energy get so frustrated with feminine women because we master the art of feminine charm which every woman out there if she's on her journey to getting in touch with her feminine core can master this right she has to feel self-assured and that comes from confidence inner confidence and she's comfortable in her femininity right she doesn't run away from being a woman she likes being a girl she likes being different from men and that's what makes it charm because she is able to make him feel comfortable and she's able to make other people feel comfortable and drop their guard just a little bit now another good a pointer about feminine influence and feminine charm is eye contact. Now, you want to avoid staring people down or being very stern or having a, a wall up uh, or your facial muscles being tense. You want to make people feel good by relaxing, by smiling, and not having such a stern face. You want to be pleasant, you want to be kind, and you want to be radiant, right? You don't want to be looks so serious because when you look serious, you make people get on guard. Like, what's wrong with her? I'm not going to make her happy. And what's going through a masculine man's mind is, I'm not going to make her happy. She looks upset already. This is going to be a tense interaction, right? And it kind of dissipates the the positive romantic connection between a man and a woman so you want to ease up on the serious look and you want to smile and you want to be soft right and you want to be radiant and you want to go in with confidence and authenticity that, that kind of relaxes the man right 
you want to be playful and here's the key you want to give him a compliment that brings out his masculinity you want to accentuate his confidence right as a masculine man they want to hear that they're confident and the key about feminine charm and influence is that you're authentic you're genuine right so when you give a compliment you want to make sure that it comes from a good place and how you make sure of doing that is you pick something about him that you genuinely feel right if you genuinely genuinely feel like he's intelligent and he gave you information that you couldn't find anywhere else you want to say wow without you I wouldn't have been able to figure this out wow you're so smart uh, these are ideas of compliments you want to give a masculine man when you're charming him or using influence you want to encourage him um, by building his ego because again you're wanting to achieve getting what you want without controlling him or making him feel like he's controlled and you want to be in your feminine energy right and it's it'll come natural to you once you practice this and you'll have have to like men in order to pull this off if you don't like men or you have uh, some type of underlying pain it's going to be hard for you to carry out feminine charm but once you heal and you like men feminine charm will be second nature to you and you'll find that you get such fulfillment uh, with your interactions with masculine men because they tend to give you what you want and they enjoy giving you what you want right it typically works for everyone to a point, but it's really uh, best to use with men. Because we're women, if you're trying to do this on another feminine woman, she's gonna know what you're up to. But when you use it with men, men understand, oh wow, she's feminine and she enjoys being a woman. And this enhances his masculinity, so he's okay with that. When you're manipulative, dominating, controlling, nagging, fussing, you have a wall up, your facial muscles are tense, your conversation is tense, um, your business like, then he's going to have his defenses up and he is not going to be easily persuaded, right? Because he's going to feel like he's somewhat being controlled or under duress. If you're confident in your femininity and you are authentic, masculine men have no problem giving you what you want if he's able to do that. And also, when you're comfortable in your femininity and you have that confidence, you're not seeking to be liked. Like you are okay with who you are and that energy rubs off on people around you. It's very charismatic. It's very intoxicating. And men love this confidence, right? It's like a, a, a moth to a flame to a masculine man. Like he's so attracted to a woman that's confident in herself. She doesn't feel the need to sell herself to others, right? She approaches just every interaction with masculine men with confidence like whether I get what I want or not it's okay I'm still me I'm still fabulous I'm still feminine and life goes on and it's that type of energy that entices a man that's and, that, and that's the type of energy that encourages the man to give her what she wants right and that's that charm that a lot of uh, women that are not so much in their feminine energy kind of like why does she always get what she wants from any man that's it it's the feminine influence it's the feminine charm and this is why feminine women whether they're married or single whatever their life story is they have fulfillment because they know how to interact with masculine men and also another key pointer I want to point out about feminine influence or feminine charm is that within a relationship, a romantic relationship with a masculine man, it absolutely enhances the connection between the man and the woman. Again, it eliminates the competition. It doesn't make him feel like he needs to be on guard, that he can't trust her, she's manipulative. Oh no, no. He feels like he has a connection with that woman because for some reason she makes him feel like a man. When a woman makes a man feel like a man, he wants to make her happy, he wants to give her what she wants, and when she uses this coming from a good place, she's authentic and she's feminine, he has no problem doing that, he has no problem making her happy. Here's the key, there's a difference between feminine uh, energy that is authentic and feminine energy that is situational and typically masculine men can pick up on it um, 
they will feel a sense of something's off with this woman I don't know what it is but it's off and so his guard will be up but when she's authentic he also feels this because even if he says no or he can't do uh, what she wants or or answer her request he still uh, is inclined to make her happy or accommodate her on some level and if he's not she's okay she's confident in her femininity she doesn't hurl insults she doesn't get upset she doesn't manipulate or cajole or control or dominate she says okay thank you very much for trying and she'll come back again and ask again and again and Thank you for joining me on this Ladylike Lessons. I look forward to seeing you again. Make sure you like and subscribe. Join Inner Beauty TV uh, and hit the bell so that you can get all of the notifications for every video release. And hopefully you can join me on a live. Um, when you hit the bell, you get all the notifications. So thank you so much for watching. You have a wonderful, charming day.